If you're too asleep to turn off your PC at the end of the night, don't worry, there's a Nina plugin for that. Let's talk about Shutdown PC. Hi, I'm Aaron, and welcome back to the Alaskan Astro Nina plugin series. We're taking a look at each of the plugins available to help enhance your experience while using Nina. If you're confused, take a look at the first video in the series. I don't know which corner that little box goes in. Take a look at that video. It talks about what Nina plugins are and how to use them in general. Yeah, in this video, we're talking about a super simple plugin called Shutdown PC. Can you guess what it does? Yeah, no surprises here. This one's a bit of a one-trick pony. You may even be thinking, this doesn't seem like it deserves its own video, and you're probably right about that, but here we are. So this plugin does exactly what it says. It simply adds an instruction you can use to add to the end of your sequence, or wherever you want, but just be prepared for what it's going to do. As I was working on this video, I was actually trying to think of reasons why you would want to shut down your PC automated at the end of the night, because it's not something that I do. I think the chief use case for this is if you're running off of battery power and you need to conserve every little bit that you can, especially if you're on a multi-night trip and recharging may not be an option for you. So once you've got all your imaging done, you've got your mount parked, you've got your camera's cooler turned off, you can tell your PC to safely shut down. This prevents any kind of file corruption that can occur if you just yank the power or let it die when your battery drops below that point. Another situation I was thinking of that's a little bit niche is if you have a weather safety monitor. If it detects rain or some other unsafe condition, after it's done doing things like maybe closing a dome or sending you an emergency message that is raining, you may want to shut down and protect your PC. When I was doing my instrument flight training, we did a lot of simulator work indoors to save time and money. Us flight students would laugh that in East Texas, we could still get an indoor simulator block canceled due to weather because of thunderstorms. Our flight school didn't want to risk the expensive computers and simulators getting fried in a freak lightning situation. So yeah, turn off your computers. As far as actually using the plugin, it looks just like this. It exists under the Utilities section of the instructions, and it's just this Shutdown PC instruction. So you can drag it in. There's nothing to configure under the Plugins tab. It just works. You do actually have the option to sleep instead of do a full shutdown, which I don't know why you do that. Maybe that's a laptop thing. But anyway, once you start your sequence and it gets through uh, everything else, as soon as it hits that instruction, it's just 